front squat. It's a variation of the squat that we do, designed to hit more of the quadriceps, front part of our legs. Um, the execution is the same as the regular barbell squat. Athletic stance, toes facing forward, feet are a little bit wider than hip width apart. We're squatting down, keeping those knees not diving in, dragging straight up through our heels. Clearly the biggest difference is how we're gonna hold the bar. Instead of the bar being on our back, we're gonna have it on the front. So about there's three different ways you can, um, you can hold on to the bar in the front. I like to do just across my shoulders, arms crossed right here. It's the easiest way for me. Um, some people like to do uh, like a, a clean grip. They have the bar held up here. I'll show you real quick. Holding the bar right there. A lot of that's just going to depend on your shoulder shoulder mobility. The more range of motion you have in your shoulders, the easier it might be for you to do. A little bit tighter for me and something I need to work on. Also, if you have uh, wrist straps, you can wrap them around the bar and hold on to the straps right in the front of your shoulders. And that is a little a variation of <coughs> not using the wrist straps and the clean grip, but allows you to hold those straps up a little bit higher if you don't have the wrist flexibility. So um, key things are the same, just in the squat, stay nice and tall, driving through your heels, now making sure that you're always going to at least 90, a little below, a little above. That way you're working the full entire muscle. So I'm gonna show you a couple more reps, then I'll show you a couple different views so we can uh, see from all angles that um, what it's supposed to look like when you're squatting. So one more time. Unrack the bar. Got an overhand grip. Feet a little bit wider than hip width apart. Stay nice and tall. Drop my hips 90 degrees. Explode up.